Hey everybody, today we got a little hydroponics project. This is a pretty inexpensive way how to make a deep water culture system. And what's going to be a little bit different about this is it's going to it's going to be air powered. You're not going to be using a water pump, you're going to be using an air pump. And we're going to make use of the general hydroponics water farm kit, which is these pieces right here. And we're using a standard sized bucket and a six inch net pot. And the net pot is going to go in the bucket lid. And then the water farm kit will be used. It'll be, we're going to tweak it a little bit. We're not going to use it the way it's set up right now. Uh, but we're going to have it be an air powered design that'll pump the water and cycle the water. It'll oxygenate the water as well. Uh, so it's a very efficient use of, of materials. And this is what we're going to be using to make this and I'll go ahead and get started on it. Okay, so here we've cut two holes into the lid of the bucket, and the small hole is for a uniseal here. That'll fit there, and then the PVC tube will fit within that, and then the water farm tube will go in there, and it's got a little divot on the side, and it'll rest without moving around too much. And of course the big hole fits the six inch net pot. go from there. Okay, so after we've assembled this piece here, we cut the ends so that it'll flow out right about in the center of the net pot, and they're slanted down at an angle so that it, we don't get drips that travel backwards. Uh, but we made use of a second elbow from a, a second water farm kit. Uh, if you only go with one water farm kit, you'll need to get another elbow. Uh, but you'll have plenty of the blue tubing from just one to do all this. So, essentially the air comes through here, bubbles through the water, and that pushes water up into the tubes, through here, and then back down into the net pot. And we'll put some clay pebbles in there, and a plant. And I'll give it a try and see how she works. Okay, so here we have the unit running. This is a air-powered deep water culture system made using a general hydroponics water farm plumbing kit. And that's the blue tube that we cut up and used. And as you can tell, there's the air line coming from the air pump. And that will both oxygenate the water and pump the water through the net pot. So it's a pretty efficient system, and we can always tweak the positioning of these, these tubes here, maybe get it more in the center, but the clay pebbles have a little bit of a wicking action to them, so once we get those put in, uh, it should keep the roots nice and wet. And pretty good flow, uh, we got the air pump on high, and this is what it's doing. Uh, see what happens when we dial it down a little bit. Okay, that's with the air pump on low. And you still get a little bit of pumping action. And that's about medium flow on the air pump. And for the air pump that I'm talking about, it's this little Eco Air adjustable pump. It's really pretty inexpensive. It was under $10. Probably available at your local hydroponics store. 
uh, but it's a really good value. And I guess the last thing to do would be to put a plant in here and start growing. So this deep water culture system is an air powered deep water culture system using a regular bucket, six inch net pot, and the general hydroponics water farm plumbing kit that we tweaked a little bit. And it's delivering a steady flow of water to the clay pebbles as well as to the chives that are planted in there right now. And this system could probably do well indoors or outdoors. I'm probably going to leave it out here on the deck for a while and see if it, how it does outdoors. Um, only thing I got to worry about is that pump. Probably want to make sure it doesn't get wet. Uh, but it's a nice, nice little pump. Very happy with it. It's under ten dollars, and and it's performing quite well. So there you have it. This is the air-powered deep water culture. Do it yourself.